Hello everyone. It is the next day. When did I upload that? Two Maybe days. a couple days later. Couple days. I don't know when today is, but <laughs> it's a few days later and I'm in the hospital now at City of Hope. Yay, Yay. I'm so happy to be here. I was at um, a local emergency hospital for from Thursday night until Sunday? No, Sunday. Monday. Sunday night or Monday night? I don't know. I think Sunday night. Days are blending together. Anyway, I was at an emer local emergency hospital for that time, and it was they were great there, so wonderful, but it was really hard to not be at City of Hope because City of Hope knows everything about me and my situation, and so they kept asking me questions there um, as if I were, like, an on oncologist, <laughs> and I'm not. Which, no offense, we seemed a lot more knowledgeable yeah, know on lot. everything which yeah we did we've been in this a while so we do know and they were trying their best but they didn't know all the answers and, and they that's were okay. so great yeah i just needed to be here and luckily my team worked really hard on getting me yes, here they were so thankful Thank for you. them um i'm still not in any shape to be filming and editing like i wanted to so i'm filming this little thing with him he's holding up the phone because i'm kind of weak I'm about to go to bed. Um, my best friend is no longer here. She went back to Oregon. Um, but I miss her and I enjoyed her time here so much. It was so nice having her. Mm -hmm. Take care of you. Help she take really care of our kids. Of she would just pet me and <laughs> rub me. And she was like wiping me down with a cold washcloth. So she was giving me sips of water all the time. Anyways, she took great care of me very loving um kyle brought my sleeping buddy for the night excuse his face Flower. flowers already <laughs> trying to rip him up <laughs> but he's really big and sturdy did you ever so, say the name of him to people no his name is brewster the kids and uh, we all decided that um brewster was a good one it's an ice cream place that we love yeah, it's all of our favorite ice cream place <laughs> so he's brewster and I have him because he helps me find some comfort in some positioning in the night um, when all else fails. And he just is a nice companion. <laughs> I miss being home with all my, with both of my animals and my kids and you. Um, I have a catheter now in the front of my chest and i've been getting that drained every day for a few days now it hurts really bad but we're trying to figure out they're very receptive to pain medication here her full pain management team is on it and they are you know getting better and better her drainings are going well even though they're really painful. Today was already more hopeful yeah, yeah. with my pain situation. <clears throat> right now my pain is pretty bad and I'm not sure why, but um, I'm gonna see my pain doctor in the morning and she'll help me um, figure it out. Um, you probably ask for a little bit before bed too. She has a couple medications she could do before bed. Okay. <clears throat> and there's a lot that's been going on. Jenny's been in the hospital now for going on five days. So it's been, you know, our beautiful children have been um, handed off to many family members. My mom hasn't tonight. Your brother, I'm sorry, your sister and brother-in-law have been amazing and taking them so much and taking care of them and people are feeding them and playing with them and taking them to swim class and um, your parents have helped. It's It's been a village, and we're so thankful because it's hard to have mommy in the hospital. And, you know, I've been here a lot with you, so mm -hmm. our kids are missing mommy. Mm -hmm. They're asking every day where mommy is and I how much longer. We just miss so them. much. But Kyle brought me, um, tell me if it shows it in the phone. Look, Kyle brought me, can you point to Oh, me? yeah, I'll point to it. This picture. My friend Bia got it for me, and it has the family in it. And 
little moving picture. <laughs> so that's set up right in front of me so that I can view it all day. And it really cheers me up. Thank you, Bia, it's perfect. I've had it for a long time at home and we use it at home, but it's perfect for being in the hospital. It is. Um, I'm not doing well, I'm really weak. I have my, I have my potty right here for the night because I can't walk too far and in the night I'm, I'm like delirious and don't know how to get to the toilet. So I have my toilet really close. Um, I could steal the phone from you again, sorry. I'm just not feeling well at all. And the goal is just to get me better and then we'll go on from there. Yep. I just can't believe how bad this is. I'll try to give you guys more info of what's happened when I can. I'm just so sick. You just focus on resting and healing and moving on. And those are orders from your doctor and your family to just rest and get this, get your body right again. So that's what, that's what Jenny's been doing. But she's getting better, I promise. And just day by day, you're super strong getting through it. Kyle's proud of himself. He did a laundry service. Oh, yeah. I got really behind help. in laundry and then being at the hospital for the last five, six days back and forth, I noticed that the laundry was just piling up. So I just Googled, um, are there, I figured there's laundry services because there's services for everything. There was, they picked it up. I just had to load it into bags. They brought it back today, one day, all of it folded, smelling great and in categories. So like my stuff was in a category, my shirts, my sweats, the kids stuff, it was amazing. So if you're falling behind and you have the means, they gave a big discount. Um, so look into it, but it was a laundry service and it was amazing. We're Any, getting by. Anything else you can think of? How are the kids? Kids are okay. The kids are hanging in. Ellis is asking a lot of questions. You know, where's mom? How much longer? How many more days? Press your little pain guy. Oh. Hi. Hi. Oh, sorry. Oh. Sorry. Um, the kids are okay. They are so resilient. Um, they do miss mommy a heck of a lot. They ask about you all the time. Where are you? How much longer? They've been FaceTiming here and there. Um, Ellis has been going to swim every day, Winnie has been being Winnie, and we're just getting by, but we're doing okay. We're hanging in there, thanks to all the help that we've got. Sorry you lost me there with the interruption, no, okay. I can't get back on track of what we were talking about. That's okay. We were just updating them, and uh, her team did come by, um, and... You know, they're the reason we're here. They got us in here. And now their goal, they said, is not cancer fighting right now. It's just getting Jenny better. So once we do that, then he said we can start cancer fighting again. But right now we're just focusing on getting you better and under control with your pain. Yeah. This is going to be your first night alone. So please pray for her. I'm, um, I'm okay. I'm in great hands. We have tons of people on. You know, I got to go be with the kids and... Ashley's gonna be with her kids and then Mel went home. So, um, but we're gonna, she's in the best place to be alone. And then we'll be back here in the morning. So, mm. continued prayers are definitely needed. Please. To get this, to get this girl up and running again. Please. And um, get you, get you back where you need to be. One day at a time. And I'm sorry, I'm like not all here. I'm just going through so much. Yeah, I'm str through really struggling and I'm hoping to be a little more myself each day as we get into this. My mouth is really dry all of a sudden. All right. Is that it? That's it. Thanks for, Thanks watching, for watching, guys. Hopefully I'll have something for you soon. Oh, we'll see. I'll update you as we go. Love you and appreciate you. Bye. Bye.